Hey guys, we are headed to CVS and we're gonna show you the best deals that you can grab for the rest of this week. Um, there's a new set of deals starting on Sunday, so hopefully I'll be able to jump on here and let you know um, what deals you can score for the next two weeks at CVS, but there are still some awesome things that you can grab for the remaining of this week. So make sure you hit that like and subscribe button so that way when the new video posts, you are the first to see it. Um, please let me know if you're new here. I would love to say hello to you in the comments and thank you so much for clicking on this video. For all of the new viewers and returning viewers, I so, so appreciate you. Let's go. First up, we're gonna grab the Sarah V for $7.59. I have a $2 insert coupon that I'm gonna use, so it's gonna knock it down to $5.59, and then we're gonna get back a $4 extra buck just for buying one, which is gonna make the final price just $1.59. Okay, next I'm gonna do this hair deal. Everybody got a $15 off $60 in hair product coupon, so I'm gonna grab three Elvive for $5.59 each, and then I have a $3 coupon that I'm gonna use. It's actually a $3 off 15 CRT in the app then i'm going to grab two of these monday like leave-in conditioners for 5.79 but they're buy one get one half off so it's actually going to total me eight dollars and 68 cents but then i have a two dollar coupon in the app and when you buy two you get four dollars in extra bucks back which is going to make my total just two dollars and 68 cents and that's before the other 15 dollar coupon then I'm going to grab two of these head and shoulders for $7.99 each, but they are buy one, get one half off. And we don't have any coupons in the app, but check your um, app for CRTs. Um, CRTs are basically just special coupons that CVS sends to some people because I know there is one floating around out there. But I do have a $2 rebate on Ibotta, so I'm going to use that, which is going to give me $4 back. So my total is going to be $11.98, and then I'm going to get $4 back. And I'm going to get $4 in extra bucks for buying two. So that's going to make my total out of pocket just $3.98. Okay, to finish up our hair care deal, I'm going to grab two of the Dove Men Plus um, shampoos. I'm going to grab one for $6.99 or I'm sorry, $6.29. No, it is $6.99. I'm sorry. And then one for $11.29. And I have a $5 off two Dove Men Hair Plus manufacturer coupon that will come off. And I did have another coupon that I thought would double dip and come off as well, but it did not come off. Um, the The lady at the register said it's because of the spend 60 sale um, because that's another $15 coupon. Um, and so it bumped that one off. So I ended up paying a little bit more, but it is okay because it's still a great deal for these products. Okay, my total for all of this is going to be $55.71, and so I need at least like $58.70 to meet my 98% rule. So I added in this $3.59 um, dry shampoo, which brought my total to $59.30. And for those of you who are like, I don't know what the 98% rule is, most CVSs will honor like say if it's spend 60 as long as you spend 98 percent of that 60 then they will honor that and give you the reward so um my total is way past the 98 percent rule so that that will be fine and i will still get the 15 dollars off so after coupons my paid out so i did end up paying a little bit higher than i had planned so i paid out 36 dollars and 30 cents but $15 and some change of that was in extra bucks I already had and then I got $19 in extra bucks back and then I got another $4 on Ibotta for the head and shoulders which is going to make my total out of pocket that I got for all of this hair care just $13.30. It would have been way cheaper and actually a minute maker if my store had the right kind of um, hair dye that I was going to get. But, you know, part of couponing is you have to kind of roll with the flow, <laughs> roll with the dices, I mean. <laughs> Go with the flow, roll with the dices because, you know, you're, you don't ever know if your store is going to have it, what you planned or not. So, um, this is still a great deal and I was very excited about it. The next deal I'm doing is on the soft soap. So I'm gonna buy two for $3.49 each, and that is gonna make my total $6.98. Then we have a $3 digital coupon in the app, and we get a $2 extra buck back, which is gonna make my total drop out of pocket uh, just $1.98 for both of these. So I think that's a fantastic deal, so I'm gonna go ahead and pick this up. 
okay guys that's all I have for y'all tonight um, I'm having to go do my shopping a little bit differently these next um, few weeks because the kids are officially out of school which means I have them all throughout the day and that for those of you who are a mama or a grandmother or take care of kids you know that they don't have as much patience <laughs> as needed sometimes especially at CVS I feel like I could keep on with them a lot easier like at Publix because they have more in stock but sometimes CVS and Walgreens you have to like kind of switch your plan around because they may not have as much in stock as you needed um, so we had a little bit of a cost today but you know what I'm gonna take any savings that I can get because that's still some awesome product and I am still waiting to get a 10 off 70 coupon I haven't got one in like two months it feels like um, I've tried all the tricks, you know, buying um, something off the, with the percent off coupon. Sometimes that triggers it for people. I have bought something literally, um, I think twice a week because I just keep getting more percent off coupons. So my total would have been a whole lot cheaper <laughs> if I would have had a 10 off 70 because I ended up spending about $16 out of pocket for all of those um, items that I got today. So if I had a 10 off 70 coupon, it would have just been like $6, which would have been much better. But you know, like I said, I'm not gonna complain. So I hope you guys have a wonderful week. Um, if you're looking for more ways to save, make sure you check out my Publix video. I should post it sometime tomorrow and, or I'm sorry, Wednesday. I'm getting all my days confused. Um, and that will show you some great ways to save on groceries. I'll see y'all later. Happy saving.